Hello and welcome to Dark Souls. It's uh, finally out for the PC. It came out in October or November on consoles. It was out on Xbox and 360. I do own a PS3, but I basically never play it. Um, I play all my games on PC uh, or PS2. Um, so I've been looking forward to getting this. It's actually quite a good reduced price, only thirty twenty nine ninety nine on Steam. So you have your PC settings are kind of basic. I've just set them up resolution nineteen twenty by ten eighty by thirty two bit, which is seems to be the best. Not many options, but don't know whether I should have anti aliasing on or not. I'll try it. It prevents screen tear, so that's good. So I've never played this before, but the reason I'm doing this Let's Play is because I've seen a lot of footage of it and it looks very appealing to me. It's supposed to be the hardest game in a long time. It was Demon Souls was first a few years back and then Dark Souls came out in the end of 2011 there. And this is Prepare to Die Edition for the PC, which is, uh, I don't know if there's a a bit of additional content I'm not actually sure but let's just start a new game been looking forward to play this adjust brightness until flame is visible and dragon invisible okay since this is a let's play and YouTube tends to darken videos I'm gonna brighten this up actually seven eight yeah if that's too bright then I hope I can actually adjust that later on I don't want it too dark I hate games where you can't see what you're doing so it that's fine maybe a bit bright controls x-axis y-axis normal camera speed 5 try 6 vibration what is this I don't have a controller so this is I'm doing this with a mouse and keyboard I do have a controller, but it's not plugged in. So if it's better to play this with a controller, which it probably is since it's a console game. This is a console port. Hopefully they've, they've done a good job of it. I really do hope. Join leaderboard. Off. On. No. I don't want to add to rankings. HUD on. Yes. Subtitles on. Definitely. Show blood on. Yes. Hell yes. Okay. Vibration, I don't, don't know where that's coming from if I don't have a pad. Okay, that's fine. Here we go. Key settings, yes. Run forward is W, run backward is S. As usual, yep. Walk forward, left control and W. Walk backward, that could be useful. Left control. So just left control, basically. But it's pretty simple. What's next? What's this? What's this? Camera move forward I. Move backward K. That's kind of confusing. Move left L. J O. Lock. Target on or off. Reset camera. This could take a while to get used to. Switch equipment. Switch right weapon V. Switch left weapon C. Why not Q and E? What's Q and E used for? Q is action jester. E is use item. Okay, we'll keep that actually. Switch right weapon V, switch left weapon C. Why can't it be a mouse button actually? Menu control select up, down. I want more in my mouse actually, so switch right weapon should be. Can I edit this? Where do I edit this? Can I scroll up for this? No. Um, actually, you know what? Mouse button? No. Mouse button's not working. Has to be a key. Slip away. Uh, see. Yeah, whatever. <coughs> Switch magic R. Switch item F. This is gonna be a pain to remember. Left weapon action block, left weapon action parry, tab, 
Yeah, I'm gonna need to get a game pad for this, probably. I don't actually have it with me at the moment. So... Select up, select down, select left, confirm, enter, cancel backspace. Okay, I hope there's a tutorial actually. And here's our character. Why are they ghostly, see-through? Let's see, enter name. Has to be my name, my channel name. One exploits. Sex. Enter. Sex male. Uh, commoner. Fat boy. Fat or thin. <laughs> Very average commoner face. Commonly seen face in the five finger delta. Handsome face of the refined. Intelligence sharp lines but scholarly looks. Invite insult. <laughs> Look common and thorough Known for its stalwart clerics. Oh, he's happy. Jovial features of Katarina. Known for festivity and drink. Dubious Karim. Ominous features associated with the art of Karim. Thoughtful mature face. Common and historical Xena. Great swamp heretics face prejudice for their atypical looks. Wait, no, 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 no. Far East Traveler, hang on. Face from a distant eastern land of almond eyes and thin lips. Looks Caucasian to me. Commoner, uh, let's just do commoner. Her receding. <laughs> Short. Ponytail, pretty basic options. Can we edit these? No. Bobbed, semi long. Parted center, wild. Uh, swap back. Shaved. Well, let's see. It's either wild or swept back. Yeah, swap back, friend. Color. Dark blue, whatever. Doesn't really matter, not gonna see it anyway underneath all that armor. So, class, we've got different classes. No, not gift. Right, whatever, I'll choose gift now. Actually, I wanna choose my class first. Back, how do I go back? Looks like I have to choose one of these. Hang on. Class. Fearless warrior. Weapon expert. High strength and dexterity. Low ranking knight. High HP. Solid armor. Not easily toppled. I like the look of that knight actually. Low ranking knight. High HP. Solid armor. It would take longer to down enemies but it would you wouldn't take so much damage. Savage bandit, high strength, wields heavy battle axe. Hunter, no. Sorcerer, sorcerer of venom. Pyromancer. Cleric. Deprived, look at him. Oh my god. Unclothed enigma, only armed with club and an old plank shield. Yeah, I think we're gonna go for knight. I would usually choose warrior, but. The warrior looks kind of not as badass as the knight looks. I want to wear that heavy plate with the big weapons. Divine holy water restores HP and status. And status? That could be useful. Goddess's blessing sounds good. Explodes upon impact black fire bomb. More deadly than STD bomb. What? Twin humanities, tiny spread called humanity, sometimes found on carcasses. Binoculars used to peer far away. Trinket, no effect, but fond memories, comfort travelers. Opens any basic lock. Initial equip for thief. Special tribal ring, HP recovers slowly while equipped. Okay, goddess's blessing. Divine holy water fully restores. I'll go for that ring actually, because it'll restore our health slowly over time, which is nice. Physique. 
we will go for very slim, no, large, very large, large upper body, top heavy, tiny head, <laughs> large head could be very intellectual, large physique, mostly lower body, rippled physique, especially upper body, yeah let's go for that, I want to make him strong, he'd be more, he's been more boring, heavy armor, so he would be quite large upper body, but lower body too, Okay, face commoner, yep, we've done that. Level 5. Vitality 14. What's all this? That's my equipment. Alright, except... Can I not change any of my uh, characteristics here? Dexterity, I suppose that's chosen by knight. Seems pretty simple so far. Not quite as in-depth as, as, be as I'd be used to. In the age of ancients... The world was unformed, shrouded by fog. A land of grey crags, arch trees, and everlasting dragons. But then there was fire, and with fire came disparity. Heat and cold, life and death, and of course, light and dark. Then from the dark they came and found the souls of lords within the flame. of the dead. The witch of Isolith and her daughters of Chaos. Gwyn, the Lord of Sunlight and his faithful knights. And the furtive pygmy, so easily forgotten. Okay, that was awesome. Gives me a good flavor of the game, very dark, which is really good. I was looking for a game that's this dark, so here we are. This is where we come in, and a prison, I think. Yes, like. indeed. The dark sign brands the undead. A 
And in this land, the undead are corralled and led to the north. Where they are locked away to await the end of the world. Full suit of armor. This is your fate. All right, here we go. Oh, even the rats are on dead. Crazy. Look at the cockroaches. Yeah. My face has been burnt. Am I on dead too? I'm not familiar with the lore of this game. So, who's he? Can I get out of here? Oh, Northern Undead Asylum. What is this? Pillage Corpse? So these guys in the background. Let me just check. Pillage Corpse. 